start of the hockey game. That's going to happen. Um, happens at this level and it happens on TV. I mean, their guy stole two points for him, you know. Uh, threw 20, 20 shots at him in the third period and have nothing to show for it. So Point blank stop among them. It yeah. was uh, Nasca right there. When he just, he just ran yeah. all the way. Yeah, we had some, I mean, there were some rebounds there, which I think, you know, if we're going to win tomorrow, we're going to have to jump on those and be a little more uh, opportunistic and be around the cage more on the second chances. But, uh, hey, sometimes you just tip your hat to your to the other goal that he was great. It did seem like in a lot of the shots, though, that they're all coming from the outside, very easy shots to read. It didn't only seem like later on that you guys were trying to get guys in the, you know, the men's club, so yes. to speak. Yep. So. No, we, the scouting report is if he sees it, he stops it. He's an all-league goalie, and he showed it tonight. So, yeah, we, we need to... We need to get to that area, obviously, to, to have some su success tomorrow. A couple of unlucky bounces. Uh, you decided to go with Adrian in the third period. Was that more uh, dissatisfaction in Jackson or just trying to screw up the troops? Yeah, a little both. You know, um, when Jackson's in the game, he's uh, retrieving wraps, helping us on breakouts, and he was he was out of it. He just looked he looked lethargic. There was no fight to his game. So you know, he's, he, that's an off night. So that, that's what I read from where I was standing, that, you know what, um, you know, he only gave up three, but it's – you know, I didn't want to take a chance in the third, so I thought Eggie did okay off the bench. That first one, uh, a little bit unlucky, though. It looked like it hit one of your defenders in front. It did. And kind of caught him out of position. And, yeah, you know. second one's a, you know, a screen. They had a, guy, a big guy at the top of the crease, and Jackson didn't fight through the screen. And, it, I mean, what a pretty good shot. I mean, went far side off the post and in. So those two really aren't his fault. So the third one's a, third one's a backbreaker, though. We're playing well, and they score on, a, on that third goal. That's That can't happen. I'll ask Chris this, and I'll ask you um, – what did, what did you see from the Crusaders tonight that you know you have to, t uh, to tackle and, and improve upon tomorrow? Well, they uh, they sacrificed for each other. They blocked a lot of shots, whether it was their forwards at the top of the box in the PK or their defensemen net front. But they're they're very and they're tough in the neutral zone. They're tough to you know to generate speed. They were stuffing us at the blue line, and um, you know we have one guy with the puck and he dumps it in, and we have the other two guys flat footed at the blue line. We couldn't get in on our forecheck. They they were really good in the, in the uh, neutral zone.